In the bustling city of Lagos, a day that started like any other for Tochi Wigwe would soon turn into a nightmare she'd never wake up from. An ordinary day, filled with the humdrum of work and the anticipation of a family reunion, quickly spiraled into a vortex of despair. Tochi, caught in the tight grip of work obligations, missed her family's flight to the U.S. Little did she know, the flight she was slated to board would never reach its destination. As the day wore on, the shocking news of a devastating helicopter crash near Nipton, on the edge of the Mojave Desert in Southern California in the United States, rang out like a death knell, reverberating through the city. Her father, her mother, and her elder brother were all snatched away in an instant. The flight manifest bore their names, a chilling reminder of the fate she narrowly escaped. In an instant, Tochi's world was shattered, leaving her in the throes of unimaginable grief. With the dawn of a new day, Tochi awoke to a reality she wished was a dream. The sun rose, casting its light upon a world that felt suddenly alien, a world devoid of the familiar laughter and love of her cherished family. The overwhelming grief was a silent storm, a tempest of sorrow and despair that threatened to consume her. The aftermath of the tragedy was a haunting echo, a cruel reminder of the sudden and senseless loss she had suffered. The laughter that once filled their home was now a hollow sound, each echo a knife to her heart. The memories of family dinners, shared jokes, and tender moments were like ghosts, haunting the corners of her mind and the chambers of her heart. The weight of their absence was a tangible thing, a crushing burden that bore down on her with relentless force. Every room held a memory, every object a link to the past, serving as constant reminders of the life she had once known. The family photographs that adorned the walls, the empty chairs at the dinner table, the silence that had replaced the cheerful banter, each was a testament to the void that had been left behind. Tochi was adrift in a sea of grief, the waves of sorrow threatening to pull her under. The pain was a living thing, a beast that lurked in the shadows, waiting to pounce when she least expected it. It was in the quiet moments, when the world around her fell silent, that the pain struck the hardest. Her heart ached with a sorrow so profound, it was as if a part of her had been ripped away, leaving a gaping wound in its place. The world continued to turn, life continued to move forward, but for Tochi, time seemed to stand still. She was trapped in a moment, a prisoner of her own grief. Yet, amidst the sorrow and the pain, Tochi found strength in the memories of her loved ones. Their spirit lived on in her heart, their legacy etched in the very fabric of her being. Their love was a beacon, a guiding light that pierced the darkness, providing a glimmer of hope amidst the despair. The void left behind was vast and insurmountable, casting a shadow of sorrow over Tochi's every waking moment. Yet, even in the face of such overwhelming loss, Tochi remained steadfast, her spirit unbroken, her resolve unwavering. In the face of profound loss, Tochi embarked on a journey through grief, a path marked by pain, sorrow, and resilience. Navigating the turbulent waters of grief, Tochi found herself adrift in a sea of sorrow, the weight of her loss threatening to pull her under. The absence of her family cut deep, leaving a wound that refused to heal, a void vast and insurmountable. Yet, amid the heartache, she found strength in the love that bound her to those she lost. Their spirit lived on in her memories, their laughter echoing in her mind, their love imprinted on her heart. Each day presented a new battle, a struggle to come to terms with the stark reality of their absence. The laughter that once filled her home was now just a distant echo, the love that once warmed her heart now a chilling reminder of what she lost. Yet through the darkness, she clung to these memories, holding on to the fragments of a life that once was. Her journey was not an easy one. It was a path marked by moments of profound sorrow, sleepless nights filled with tears, and days where the weight of her loss threatened to crush her. Yet, through it all, she found resilience in her sorrow, strength in her pain. Her family's love became her anchor, their memories her refuge. She found solace in their shared stories, comfort in their shared dreams. Their love, though physically absent, was ever-present in her heart, a constant reminder that they were still with her, in spirit, if not in form. May the souls of Tochi's father, Herbert Wigwe, her mother, Chizoba Wigwe, and her elder brother, Cheesy Wigwe, rest in peace. Please subscribe to our channel and like our video.
Be a catalyst for meaningful impact today. Together, we can make a difference. One story at a time. I love you all.